Hey guys, it's Annie here, back again with another one of our awesome native Australian reptiles. Today I'm here with King. Now King here is a frilled neck lizard or a frilled dragon. Now, as you can see, he does have lots of excess skin around the back of his head here. Now it is folded back at the moment. It is connected to lots of little spikes that do join onto his jaw. So when he's feeling quite threatened, what he'll do is he'll actually open his mouth up, flash some nice sharp teeth, which will also then extend that frill as well, which is enough to deter even the biggest of predators. It can make them look much bigger and much scarier than they actually are. When they do scare off a predator, they will actually run away on two legs. They do look quite goofy. Uh, a lot of people call them a bicycle lizard as well. So they'll actually extend that frill, they'll hiss and carry on, and then they'll run away on two legs with their chest up nice and high, trying to be big and freaky. Now they do also use that frill to fend off rival males, and they will also use it to attract themselves lovely ladies as well. Now he is an insectivorous species of lizard, but he does also eat other things. So he's not only eating insects, that is what his diet primarily consists of, because it is one of the easiest things for him to run around and grab. Uh, so he is actually an ambush predator. So he will wait for things to come along. He has incredibly good eyesight. He does rely quite strongly on that to spot the tiny little insects running around. And he'll grab those as well. But he can also eat things like small reptiles, maybe small lizards. Uh, he could take down a bird, a small bird, if he got his mouse around it. So they are quite a savage little hunter. Uh, they are found up in tropical North Queensland, so quite a warm, humid environment. They are very, very beautiful to see out in the wild. They are an iconic species, as you can see. There is good reason for that, and that is that beautiful frill there. So King here, he's halfway through his lunch at the moment. He's already had a couple of nice juicy worms to coax him out. So we might actually chuck him back and give him some nice wood roaches to snack on for doing a good job and being good for the camera. But other than that, guys, thank you for listening to me. I will be back again very soon with another one of our awesome reptiles. So until then, enjoy and see you guys next time.